welcome back to my men's grooming series. So today I wanna to talk all about deodorants. So if you've been using your deodorant for the last couple of years, then it is time to switch it out. Did you know that your armpits can actually become immune to the ingredients in your deodorant over time and become less effective? If you do want to avoid having stinky or sweaty armpits, then it is best, ideally, to switch out your deodorant brand every six months. Like I mentioned in my series intro video, in order to bring you all of these videos sponsor free, I'm asking you to please use the links in my companion article to make your purchases. Before we get into the best deodorants, I just wanna go over a few things, starting with most women's opinions about men and sweat slash body odor. First, sweat. Unless it's excessive or you're just soaked everywhere, it's not gonna be a deal breaker for most women. Just like men, we sweat too, and it's a perfectly natural thing. What is a deal breaker is body odor. There's just no excuse for it. The other thing that grosses women out is when a man has just chunks of deodorant in his armpit hair. Ooh, that's just gross. It's like dandruff. No, no, no. Next, let's talk about deodorants versus antiperspirants because there are definitely very strong opinions about the two. So deodorants help prevent body odor, which is caused by the bacterial breakdown of sweat. Now, it's not gonna help you from sweating though, it's only going to prevent body odor. Antiperspirants, on the other hand, stops your armpits from producing sweat, which is why people who sweat a lot prefer this over deodorants. Aluminum is the active ingredient which physically blocks your pores from producing sweat. And this is where the controversy lies because there have been claims that aluminum may be linked to breast cancer and Alzheimer's. And just on top of all of that, aluminum mixed with sweat is what causes those yellow pit stains in your shirt. If you are not a heavy sweater, then please stick with deodorants over antiperspirants due to the health concerns. So before we get into the best deodorants, I just wanna go over really quickly gel versus stick versus roll-on slash sprays. So it's honestly all preference. Now, there's going to be pros and cons to each one of them. So with gels, it goes on invisibly, which is great, but it does leave that wet, stick, sticky feeling until it dries. So some men just don't prefer that sensation. Now with sticks, they go on dry, and some say they can hold off body odor longer, but their biggest con is that they can leave crumbles or flakes in your armpit hair, and they can leave white marks on your shirts if you apply before you put your shirt on. With roll-ons or sprays, they dry within seconds, but they may not provide the best coverage compared to gels or sticks. So when it comes to deodorants, there's a couple of them that the groomers I spoke with love and that came on top during our testing. So first is this crystal body deodorant stick. So it's actually a natural mineral salt and it's only $6. It's going to last you four years. On their website, they say it lasts you like up to a year. No, I've had mine for like five years and it's still going strong. Dorian loves this one. It's fragrance free um, and it's a really great option. But do remember though, every six months, you do wanna switch up your deodorant brand. So six months on with this one, six months off and then use a different brand and then you can come back to this. And next I have Tom's Natural Deodorant. So this is their Mountain Spring Scent, which I really like because it smells like freshly laundered clothes. Now they have a bunch of other scents but if you are sensitive to fragrances, they have an unscented version, which will be great for you. So this will provide you 24 hours odor protection, love the natural ingredients, and it's a solid gel stick. So it goes on invisible like gels, but it's in a solid state, so it doesn't leave you with that wet, sticky feeling. So I always think that's a bonus, and it's budget friendly. Another option is Dove's Men Plus Care Extra Fresh Deodorant Stick. I always wanna call it extra clean because it smells like a bar of soap. This one's really great because it's their clinical formula. So if you're a man that struggles with really strong body odor, then you want this guy because it's going to help prevent body odor for the next 48 hours and it's budget friendly. Finally, 
I've got Jack Black's Cool Control Natural Deodorant. So this is your luxury deodorant. It's gonna have a higher price tag, but the ingredients, the quality of the ingredients justify the price. So it's free of aluminum, free of alcohol and parabens, and it has antibacterial and antifungal ingredients that are natural that help combat body odor for 24 hours. And on top of all of that, it has a really light, pleasant smell to it. As for antiperspirants, since I don't recommend them, I didn't want to waste either of our times discussing them, but I also didn't want to just leave the people that actually need an antiperspirant hanging, so I included all the best ones in my companion article, which I've linked in the video description. Ugh, description. Video description. So be sure to check that out, and I will see you in the next one. Bye!